Hi Jurassic Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw Tom from Tom and Jerry. So let's get started. To draw this cute cat, let's first start by drawing his eyes. So I'm going to come right here and draw a big oval. So just the top of it. I'm just going to go up nice and high and come right back down. And then I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. So just a little bit of space, just enough for say a nose. And then about right here, go ahead and do the same thing. From there, I'm going to come to the center and I'm going to draw Tom's nose. So right in here, I'm just going to draw oval, round it off, right in between the eyes, round it off, and then connect at the center. And then I'll come in here, give it a little highlight right here at the top of an oval and then shade everything else in. Okay, so the reason I left it open is because under these eyes, I want to draw a curve that goes right over the nose. So right here, I'm just going to come to a little bit outside of the nose, I mean the eyes, and then just draw a curve right across. Now that I have that in, let's come back in here and I'm going to draw another oval, just the top of, tops of it, and then come in right towards the edge and same thing over here. So if it's easier, you can always just draw this um, big oval right here and just put a curve under it first. Just the way I did it, I was just able to make a big curve right underneath. Okay, so then from there, let's draw a circle right here and here and I'll shade everything else in. Okay, so now we have Tom's eyes and let's come to the bottom of the nose and we're going to draw the mouth. So it comes straight down the center, just a straight little line right there. And then we're going to curve outwards, nice and wide, right underneath the eye. So same thing here, nice and wide and right underneath the eye. Then right underneath here in the center, we're just going to draw a lightly soft curve. Then from there, let's come to the top, almost forgot, nice and high, say about right here. Let's draw his brow. So the brow kind of curves downwards right over his eyes. So I'm just going to bring a big curve down. And then up here, I'm just going to draw some zigzags to thicken up the brow. So same thing here. So right about here, draw a curve, it comes all the way down and thicken it up. Then right in the center here, he has this marking. So just to make it simpler, I'm just going to put three curves. And then the center one's higher, and then one more. But if you want to make it exactly, there's a one, two, three, four, five. There's actually five curves in here if you want. So I'll just make that three. And then from there, let's come to the sides, and we're going to draw his cheeks. So right next to the eye, right here, I'm going to draw a big curve and same thing over here. Nice big curve and then using that curve, I'm going to draw a curve right underneath. So I just imagine a curve right underneath this. So let's come about right here and here and let's connect it. Now that we have this part in, we can start to frame his face. So I'm going to come to the center, say about right here, not too high, about right here. I'll give myself a point. And from there, I'm going to start to draw a curve that comes down. So just draw a curve right here on the top, for the top of his head. And then I'm going to start to slope down. So close to his brow, let's work on this side first. I'm going to come down right there. And then as I head towards this area, I'm going to start to go a little bit wider and then 
around the cheek area or flare it out with some zigzags. And so this one's the center one, nice and big and low and sharp. <laughs> then bring it in and then maybe one more. Then bring it in, following the bottom right here. So you just want to have this little angle part that comes out. So let's do the same thing on the other side. Close to the brow, follow it. And we're going to start to slope down. And then about this area right here, go ahead and start to zigzag. Out nice and sharp. And back and follow right underneath. Okay, so then now let's go back and draw his big ears. So in this area right here, I'll just say about here, I'll give myself a point and about right here. I'm basically going to, let's see, I'll come, it's easier for my hand, so I'll draw from the bottom up, round and out. Round off the tip and bring it right back down to your point. Her big ear. And then right here for some details, I'm just gonna Come about right here. It's going to get thicker towards this part. And then we can draw some of his fur in his ear. So same thing on the other side. Just try to point across, approximate. And right here. So up in this area. And once again, this time I'll go from the top. And just drag this point across, so we're approximately the same height. And about right there, go ahead and round off the tip, curve, and then round off the bottom just like the other side and in. And once again, the inside. Now, um, one more thing, I almost forgot. Let right here, let's give um, Tom here some whiskers. So we're just gonna pop out two curves and same thing on the other side. There, okay, so then let's bring this curve in so we can start to draw Tom's body. Let's come in here, right underneath. So we're bringing it to the center. And now that we're pretty centered, let's imagine he has shoulders. So um, about right here, pop out some shoulders, nice and high. And then imagine his armpits. So say right here and here, I'll just give myself a point. From there, I'm going to start to draw a slight angle line to start his body. So let's bring this down. We're going to get a little bit wider as we come down and keep bringing it down. And then I'm going to get wider coming out. And so I'll just imagine, so I'll say about right here. I'll go ahead and give myself a curve. This is the center where his legs are going to start to part. And then from there, let's bring a slight angle out. And this is going to come together. And right here, we're going to start to curve. Nice and low curve. And in. So this part right here, he bends a little bit. And then right here, another curve. And then we're going to, uh, let's see here, come back right here, and pop out his feet. So pop it out, curve right here. Little angle, and we're just going to bring it right back to right there. So this part is much um, shorter than the top. So same thing over here. Curve it out. This little angle here, and bend it, and here as well. And we just want to make sure the same angle, same level, I mean. And then from there, once again, come out, pop it out, and connect. 
Okay, so then from there, I know this looks really weird right now. Let's come back right in here and we're just going to draw some zigzags for fur. So now that makes it looks a lot better, right? And then for his feet, let's come right here where you popped it out and then draw a curve, comes in and another curve. So same thing here. So where we pop this part out, curve and curve. And then now let's come back to his arms. So I'm going to bring this up a little bit higher. Maybe about there. And then we're going to start his arms. But his armpits were right here, remember? So then about right here, I'm going to come out, and work on this arm first, bring out a curve. We're going to bend it a little bit downwards to so just follow about right there. I'll go ahead and draw his hands. So come out, curve, curve. Then on this side, it's going to angle. So we're drawing basically Tom's hand in a fist. So right in here, where you in, draw a little curve right there zigzags for his fur and then you can draw some lines right there for fingers. So same thing on the other side. So remember his armpits are here. And then we're going to start to angle it down. So just follow. And about right there, same thing. Come out. Curve and another curve. Now once again, angle, angle, <laughs> angle, and connect. And that's a weird shape. But then right here, go ahead and just add that curve. Zigzag. And wait, what? Two, three. Okay, there. That looked weird, right? <laughs> okay, so then let's come to the center. Uh, about right here. Give myself a point, and from there I'm going to draw a curve. Just imagine you're drawing like a heart. And then we're going to bring this down close to the edge. Nice and round and towards the bottom. And same thing on the other side. And connect. There, and then last but not least, his tail. So about right here, I'm gonna go ahead and pop out a tail, so curve it out. And bring it right back in. And then right here, some zigzags for the ends. And that is pretty much it, except I'll put a little heart right here to make it my Tom from Tom and Jerry. So I really hope you love how Tom the cat here turned out and if you do love it and you want me to draw Jerry as well definitely let me know in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.